Let's talk health now. Nasarawa State Government has commenced the sensitization of residents on the need for young girls to get vaccinated in order to eradicate the human papilloma virus in the state. This is in line with the federal government's plan to vaccinate young girls between the ages of 9 and 14 years against the infection. Gordon Aguam has more. The human papilloma virus is a sexually transmitted infection which is a major cause of cervical cancer among women in the country. To tackle this head-on, the federal government approved the commencement of the first batch of vaccinations against the virus in 16 states, and this includes Nazarora. It is in furtherance to this that the Nazarora state government is organizing this sensitization workshop for representatives of the Nigeria Medical Association, Nigeria Labour Congress, Nigeria Union of Journalists, religious associations, among others. This is get towards enlightening them on the essence of the vaccination and stepping it down to residents of the state. We organize this so that uh, the stakeholders should meet, we close rank, we discuss, we explain to them how important it is so that uh, the implementation is at the corner after the meeting, the engagement meeting, they are meant to go back to their respective community also to enlighten them. Participants at the workshop are committed to stepping down this information to all nooks and crannies of the state. Some of our parents lack the knowledge of allowing their children to be vaccinated. Thereby, when uh, uh, health uh, uh, officers reach to them for vaccination, they deny them the opportunity to vaccinate their children. So we we'll have to get our, our Muslim brothers and sisters, even at the church, give them the knowledge that vaccination is not killing. We spoke about drama. We also do that. You know, these are subtle entertaining ways that can get to people to embrace whatever uh, plans, whatever programs, you know, uh, the government has for us. The vaccination will help eradicate cervical cancer and reduce mortality rates among women in the state. Godwin Aguam, TVC News, Lafayette.